Mr. Pesha say, I called off my engagement to come see you? That's crazy. I love you, baby. I appreciate you. I feel like it may have been another cable here, under here. So how long was your um, your hands to your waist? Was that something new? Oh, that was new. Oh, um, oh you mean the zip tie? Yeah, yeah. the zip tie. This cheer. was new. I don't remember this being put on. I've been searching my brain. One extended time period, or was it over multiple days? Or it's all done in one extended time period. Um, and I know that the older one, the day that you left, to the day that uh, it's, you were only at one location, to the best of your knowledge. Latina girls threw ice and made Hitler salutes at her father. When the author confronted the girls, one supposedly attacked her, and the author proceeded to beat her up badly, breaking her nose and silly ruin any chances of her saving her marriage. Then there's the obvious possibility that she was lying about the abuse all along. Something she's proven to be very skilled at. You came back to that. Ultimately, no. you left them every day at daycare. So it's not like they ended in terms of just chatting to us plan to get away. No. 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 You were getting all the Don Mitsky the night before. Why did I do that? Hey, my loves. So, this vlog is just not, I don't know what's going on because, yeah. Um, but I'm going to end it tonight because it's just not making any sense to me. And I don't even know what I'm going to be editing, to be honest with you. 
but um, today is Monday, June 24th. Um, so just a recap, I never did come back on camera. I vlogged for the Chris Brown concert, which was June 7th, it's June 24th. I have not really been vlogging in between time, in between the time of then to now, because I did the get ready with me. So of course, I want to show you guys a little bit of the concert. So just a brief recap on the concert. The concert was good. We all know that Chris Brown is an amazing performer. The props and the visuals were amazing. I went to the concert, we was like, oh, it's gonna be a 10 out of 10. Walked out the concert. I gave it a 7.5 out of 10 and that's just me being picky because and I, I I know I'm not the only one I wanted him to do like a little section or throw in some of his older songs like you know in the 2000 early 2000s and you know stuff that I heard in high school and I can't expect that because <laughs> he's gonna do what's current what's now and so that kind of just, it was a little, it was slightly underwhelming for me. The older songs that he chose to sing, I was like, why did you choose that? I You, you know we want to hear this. But he had like some trick. I don't know why these, sing, these singers, rappers or whatever do these trivia games at a concert. You, you can't hear our answers. Like, I don't know. They do these trivia games with their songs so they can move into the next song. I guess they're trying to be fun or whatever. You can't hear what we're saying. Just play what you know we want to hear. So he had that going and they picked a song. He was just, I know he was just trying to, you know, fit in what he could because he got a lot of songs. But anyways, that was just me being picky. The DJ played the songs that I wanted him to sing. You know how the DJ be, you know, coming out to, um, while the artists like you know go and change their clothes take a piss get some water whatever they're doing in the back he was playing the songs that i wanted chris brown to sing okay but other than that like i do enjoy the songs that i know on his new album and you know it was fine everything was cool um but he did play a lot of new stuff he was really promoting his out al his album which he's supposed to do i just wanted a little time i just wanted 15 minutes of that nostalgic <laughs> you know just that vibe um i did go and see bad boys i went to go see bad boys that was good it i was it was decent it it's worth looking at it's worth watching i feel like people are going to see it because everybody has seen bad boys one to bad boys three so of course people were go we're going to see four i did feel like um the beginning was kind of rushed I don't know it was something about it but i do feel like that needs to be the last one that's about it that's i haven't really been doing anything else as you guys can see i was braiding my hair yesterday which was what yeah which was sunday yesterday and i only had red hair in my closet i'm like since when i always have a pack of black hair and i do have a pack of black hair but I only got 30 inches and 36 inches when I did those short braids and I wasn't about to do that style again. I needed something quick so I just used those red braids. <laughs> I used that red hair and this is what it's looking like and I don't like it. I mean I don't like it but I need. I was so desperate I needed something done to my hair. I'm having like major like I'm just very stressed out about my hair. And I just really want to shave it off bald. I know for sure I'm going to get a haircut soon and I have to start over. It's just the thought. I, I can't. I, ha I don't have the energy to maintain it like I used to do years ago. I used to be so obsessed with my hair and just scared to cut it. And I, I had a routine now. Yeah. I now. No. I don't even care anymore. I know what I need to do to get it back. But my hair growth has stopped and it's just it's a damage it's not healthy like it used to be I just need a good treatment in a cut but I had to put something in it like I just really did um so yeah and I'm like I just got to deal with these red braids but anyways that's that I want to end this hair vlog I want to show you guys what I got from five below 
um, I did go to Dollar Tree the other day. I went in, why did I go in there? Oh, I went in there to get some cups. I, I got, um, I did get a few other things. They didn't really have much, but I got a bunch of socks. I got the Jello dipping dots, Beavis and Butthead for my boyfriend, and Dr. Pepper for my aunt. This here, this stinks. This Power Stick All Day Body Spray. This scent right here, Intensity, that smells so bad. No. Now, I have the other scent. That one is called Cool Blast. Absolutely love it. I'm going to mention it in my favorites. I should be filming my favorites this weekend. Well, no. Well, maybe this weekend. Sometime this week or this weekend, the Lord's will. I love that. It's the Power Stick and it's called Cool Blast. I'll talk about it more in my favorites, but the intensity, do not get this unless you like it, but I don't like it. I smelled, I, I smelled this like a few weeks ago and, and, and I didn't like it and I smelled it last Friday and some reason my nose was like, okay, this smelled good. Like, girl, it didn't smell good the first time. And so I learned my lesson when I got home, but this smells bad. I'm so mad because they had the be pure. Neutrogena Hydro Boost line. Everything was in stock but the, the wipes. And I only picked up two packs when this very first came out. And I haven't used the other pack because I'm waiting until I can get some backups. Who, I don't know who told who to buy all the makeup wipes, but you didn't think about me. You just bought them and you didn't think about me. <laughs> But anyways, I wanted to try the, the hydrating hand cream, the gel cream. Um, I tried a little bit. It felt a little like um, like it's sitting on top of the skin. So I got to try it again. But anyways, I picked that up. Um, I needed some rubber bands just, just because. And then I did pick up the Sassy and Chic Travel Brush set. They had the purple, like, pink packaging, but I don't know. I thought this was more summery. And then, um, I went to Five and Low today. And I got a few things. I just went in there just because I picked up these eyelashes from Kiss. I've never seen these before. Oh, now, maybe they are, like, a Five and Low exclusive. <laughs> I don't know. I've never seen these before. Um, I got this simply for the packaging, I like the packaging because it said glam on it. But to be honest with you, the lashes are, they are dramatic. I wish these lashes were more wispy. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna brush them out with a spoolie and just like make them a little rough because these are not wispy enough for me. Like I'm, I just don't wanna plop them on my eyes like that. They look like very costume-like. So, yeah, I'm going to take my spoolie and just really rough them up. And then I got this pair. This is the Kiss Uncovered collection. I thought this was cute. This is Dewy. And then I picked up two makeup brushes from Moda. This, this was the last one, and I know the box is terrible, but I, I wanted this brush so bad. So I got a contour and a round powder brush. So here's the brush. And this one is for a contour, so I'm going to see how I like it. I don't think, I don't know. I use it for something else, but yeah, that's for contour. And then this one is for powder. So this is the round powder brush, and I got it because of the handle. <laughs> I'm like, ooh, that is cute. I like how fat it is. <laughs> it's so cute. I don't know, but the, the bristles just feel cheap and last but not least like i am so happy that i caught this here because it was only three left and i would have been so mad this is so freaking cute stop i love cheetah girls and I could have sworn that I was a part of the group. Like, I wanted to dress like them. The aesthetic, like, ugh, the way they used to dress in high school when they used to go to school. Like, I wanted to dress like that. But no, you know, the school I went to, everybody was, like, so caught up on name brands, having the latest Jordans. Like, I can't keep up. Like, y'all gonna get these Air Force Ones and call them a day. But I wanted to, like, they were cute. They were girly. Like, Cheetah Girls, Sister Sisters, Lizzie McGuire, 
Moesha. Like, I wanted to dress like them going to school. But yes, I was so happy when I seen this because it just brought back memories. And now I kind of want to watch it. They need to, they need to like get their selves together and make another Cheetah Girls. I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog. I just wanted to like recap you guys on what's going on because I know this vlog is not that long. So I still wanted to put it up for you guys. So anyways, I will talk to you guys in a, another video. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys comment down below and like the video and subscribe if you like what you see and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.